welcome to this video so this is our making of our ovi raptor so here's our ovi raptor planned and sketched so you can see this is the redesign of the body and the real ovi raptor's body and from jurassic dominion so i got the heads this is a normal minifigure it's actually branded i think it doesn't it's not visible okay so i that so it's not visible me actually that way that's it you can now see that and now here's um the ov raptor sketched and aluminum foil keep the part so this is the base layer of our ov raptor so now we will do some sculpting on this so i'll show you so now we are going to sculpt it so um i will show you it of the sculpted so let's move on to sculpting so here's our ov raptor of the sculpting wow this looks amazing i think so it's based on this design only so and the redesigned head this is the real ov raptor's head some images and this is the dominion ov raptor's head and here it was the body design and now here it looks like um actually one i one pair hand i forgot to make so i need to make that now so this hand also is in to um, perfectly stand so okay that's actually two thirds on the bottom of the legs as you can see the hand is actually in so i need to take this and you can see the hand is facing inwards so I need to make another hand, and this is the comparison between a man. So, I think it is okay sized compared to the man, and it is dominant. Okay, so um, here you can see. Wow, the head looks also nice compared to the drawing. It looks nearly the same. So that's the Oviraptors. Okay. So now let's move on to the painting part. So, okay, let's move on to painting. I stick some foam on our ovi raptor, so it looks like it's feathers, so blue foam. As you can see, I used a different clay in this figure, so this clay works really well than that. So, um, I will leave a link down in the description below where you can buy it. So. So now here is our OV raptor after the feather was sick, and I made the other hand, which is here. This is our one hand, the other hand in this side. So here's it is. That hand is actually underneath the body. So now it's drying. It should be in this pose, in this posture. So now you can see that it's okay. So the body is like a raptor only. So. Um, normal Legos Raptor's body only. So now only I stick this. So this clay takes around 24 hours to dry. So wait for 24 hours, then only it will dry. Every clay um, has 24 hours to dry, but the other clay I was using before dries in three to four hours. So now let's meet in the painting thing. Okay, so let's move on to painting. Here's our over up to up the painted fully in white. So now I'm going to color it um a light gray, which is you can see this color on the whole body. So it is actually placed um based on the Dominion Prologues over up to. So now we are going to fast forward coloring it. Let's start. So now um, we fast forwarded the coloring of our OVR Raptor. So hope you enjoyed it. So now we are going to put some lines on our OV Raptor with black color. So um, as per the prologue, it's from here to here some both the outs. So the camera actually fell down but nothing else happened. So now we can see the coloring of the black. And some stripes which goes here. There you go. I'll go to the another side also. 
so that's the um, coloring so now i will put some red in the beak and head and some more colorings so i'll meet you after doing that so i finished coloring our ov raptor so here it is after colored i drawn it some eyes and some red colorings to it so it looks awesome cool and awesome so it's made out of scratch um, no lego pieces needed for this so um sorry for the video no video for nearly 10 days so this is um, from now on i'll put videos regularly in three days gap so um so um, wait for the future video so now let's look the closer look with our ova raptor so let's move on to closer look so here is our closer look in our ov raptor first let's see the comparison between a man okay so this comparison looks nearly like this which is going to come here so this was actually based from the prologue not from the movie so the um, um the size comparison will come here right now so here's on just turn turned so up so okay there we go so now that's the comparison i think they book both look really really same size so now i think here is it so the ov raptor comes from jurassic world dominion movie in the jurassic um, series or movie series only comes in the aw d so that's jurassic world dominion so here it is here it is and it's correctly six third wide it can fit into a six third wide box so they one two three four six so it's correct six thirds wide so the over raptor is actually six feet length so i think it matches up correctly six thirds one third equal to one feet so this is six feet so okay this over raptor looks very good so now i think i'm going to show you it in the zooming version to do you so i think they look pretty well and start receivers i use black coloring for that okay i could have kept a stud on top that it will make it um, big um should be big to keep a stud on top so it's actually quite small so i didn't keep a stud on top but this looks really really cool so now let's move on with the size comparisons so, so now we are here with our size comparison with our altimosaur the altimosaur is very very large so see it quite a lot so very very big compared to the oviraptor i think the oviraptor size of the moros so which comes in jurassic World dominion okay so let's see this and it should open its mouth so and now i'll first fix fix the um, ov raptor which going to be facing okay so now there we go so that's the size of the moros actually so i'm planning on to make um moros into turtles so but that also on the plan but it should be a bit smaller than the ov raptor so like this size um till its leg height so now the ultimate sword size comparison so here it's the ultimate sword leg so that's the size and the hands it's actually very very large so i'm going to take it out so and that's it for our size comparison so now compared to the human actually it's the same size so now okay fans let's keep this here so Okay friends, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, share and like. So, bye bye. Let's meet in the next video.